If I had a nickel for every time someone had asked me, how do I clean my blinds, I'd have at least 13 nickels. So for those of you who have asked, in this video, I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to clean your horizontal and vertical blinds. That's why I wore my horizontally striped dress. There seems to be two main schools of thought when it comes to cleaning slatted blinds, vertical or horizontal. The first involves a simple use of a cloth, some dish liquid, water, a bucket, and your hands. Now the second involves taking the blinds down, putting them in your bathtub, scrubbing them, drying them, and then putting the blinds back up. To me, one measure seems reasonable and the other, let's say extreme. I've never had anything so nasty on my blinds that it required me to remove them from the windowsill and actually clean them. So with that in mind, let me show you the first method, how to clean your blinds using a few simple tools. I should mention that this method works wonderfully on aluminum, plastic, or wood blinds. However, I wouldn't recommend it for fabric blinds, which actually do need to be taken down, perhaps even unstrung and bathed in warm, not hot, soapy water, rinsed well, and left flat to dry. First thing we'll do is get as much dust off the blind as we can using a duster, or better yet, a vacuum. For horizontal blinds, work top to bottom, and for vertical blinds, work left to right. If you're using a vacuum, select a brush attachment, and if you're going to dust by hand, you can choose one of several dusting tools, including a proper blind duster like this one, a simple microfiber cloth, or even an old sports sock turned inside out and worn on your hand as a sock puppet. Then you can do a puppet show after. I find feather dusters throw too much dust around, so I avoid them altogether, even though they do make you look like a sexy French maid. Now for the actual washing part. Add three drops of dish liquid into a bowl or a bucket and fill with warm water. Take a microfiber cloth and dunk it into the mixture. Ring well to the point of the cloth being damp dry. Now twist the blind slats so that they lie completely flat. Take your cloth and starting from the top for vertical or left for horizontal, pinch the cloth around each blind slat and wipe away dirt and dust by pulling the cloth to the other end of the slat. Rinse your cloth as you go and you'll be surprised and a little disgusted about how dirty your cloth is going to get. If you have heavy staining on the blinds like grease, dead bug residue, dog slobber or nicotine, you can add a bit of baking soda to the wash, like say a tablespoon and that should help break down the scummy buildup. If you have vertical blinds, the steps are the same, except you'll have to start at the top of the slat and work your way down to the bottom. You might need a step ladder to do this too. Once your blinds are clean, you can maintain them by dusting on a regular basis using a simple duster or your vacuum. Just turn the blinds upright and work from the top and make your way to the bottom. That's all there is to it, and the best part is you don't have to fiddle with your blinds by taking them down, waiting for them to dry, and then putting them back up. And a quick note on cleaning fabric blinds, I don't have any to demonstrate on, but what I do recommend is to vacuum them regularly to avoid buildup and discoloration. I've got a question for the Clean My Space community. When's the last time you cleaned your blinds? If you want to see more of our cleaning videos, why not subscribe? It's completely free and the button is easy to use. It's right down there, unless they've moved it and it's up there somewhere, or maybe now it's on the side. I don't know, depends when you're watching this video. Another thing we'd love for you to do is to send us your pictures, your before and after shots of any room or cleaning project that you've taken on. You can send it to us at melissa at cleanmyspace.com. And you can see we love featuring your pictures because they provide so much motivation and inspiration to other people. You can see some of them right here. And if you send yours in, maybe I'll give you a nice little shout out on Facebook or I'll put yours in an upcoming video. Don't forget, as always, if you found the video helpful to give us a thumbs up. You can visit cleanmyspace.com, which is our wonderful blog for more cleaning information. And we thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.